Welcome to Built on Faith Homestead or Leaving Egypt, depending on which video platform you prefer to watch your content on. My name is Justin, and in today's video, we are going to be breaking down our home raised beef uh, that we named Forest. Uh, you can go back and watch even some of our previous videos. Now, I will say that if you want the details on how we do this today, you will have to go over to Rumble. Uh, that part will be Rumble exclusive. Uh, but at the end of the day, you just got to get the meat off the bone and into the freezer. He has already been skinned and gutted, and he's been hanging for about a week. Now, if you notice, there's something different about me right now. I have no glasses. Um, my glasses were just old, and the other day I was out working on some firewood, and they just, the nose piece just fell apart. It, it didn't, like nothing hit it, none of that. It just, it just fell apart. Um, I guess they have something, that glue that holds the little nose piece in place. Um, I guess it only lasts about two and a half, three years. That way you make sure you have to go to the eye doctor the next time. Um, luckily, my vision's not too terrible. Uh, I'm farsighted. I'm not super bad farsighted. Um, I, I do need them for my astigmatism more than anything. Uh, but I'll be able to, to manage. It'll just be a little bit slower today. Uh, but we're going to get through this thing. Uh, it doesn't really matter, right, that my glasses are broke. Like, I have to do this today because the weather's going to get too warm to the point where I'm not comfortable letting this carcass continue to hang. Uh, today will be fine, tomorrow maybe, uh, but the next few days after that, definitely not. And so, um, I will have to, I'm just going to have to do it without glasses. My wife's going to help me, our kids are going to try to get them involved somewhat today. And uh, we're going to try to put some meat in the freezer, which is important. Uh, in the current climate that we live in for grocery store prices and the fact that like this wasn't raised in a lab <laughs> This is real. This is a real cow that we're gonna eat Appreciate you guys. Like I said, if you want to see the details You'll have to go over to rumble at leaving Egypt. There'll be a link in the description box down below. 